My name's Ed Walls, I'm the assistant manager at the Seymour Fish Hatchery and we're doing some fin clipping of some coho juveniles. So what we're doing is we're anaesthetising the fish so that they are, um, we can actually handle them. They're uh, a little bit wiggly otherwise to try and do a clip on. So the aim is to get them nice and sleepy so they're nice, nice and docile. It makes it easier for the clippers to make, to handle the fish and it also means we get much better clips. You, it would be impossible to cut these things if we hadn't, if we don't anaesthetise them. We're removing the adipose fin so that we know they come from the hatchery rather than the wild when they come back as adults. We clip at this stage, um, the fish are about 5 grams currently and it's a good size for us to clip them. Um, it means we, get, we make good clips so all the fish um, have their adipose completely removed hopefully. Um, if they're much smaller than that it does get more difficult to clip them. A big part of what we do at the hatchery is um, helped by volunteers. We only have three full-time staff, um, so volunteers are essential for us doing some tasks. Volunteers can help, help out with tasks like fin clipping, like we're doing here. Um, we do seining of adult fish, we do broodstock collection um, and spawning. Um, they're probably the main ones. We do some work with fertilizing eggs and egg picking as well. If you want to get involved, in volunteering with the Seymour Salmonid Society. Um, probably the best way to do it is to go to our website which is seymoursalmon.com um, and there is an online form you can fill out and we will contact you. You'll become part of an email list and we will advise you of any upcoming volunteer activities and that you may be interested in. Mm -hmm.